Hi guys, welcome to my channel Edutech Idea. In the series of Manage Engine Endpoint Central tutorial, today I will guide you the configuration features of the Endpoint Central. So, what is the benefit of this tool? Let's start friends. First, we need to log in the Endpoint Central. I have already logged into the Endpoint Central and go to the configurations tab and go to the click on the configuration. Go to the win for Windows. Here we can multiple configuration. You can see here. We can create here the alerts to the endpoint machines. We can browser setting to the endpoint setting endpoint machines. You can click here, uh, click on the browser, and you can deploy the setting of the browsers to the endpoint machines directly to the console. Okay, and you can also uh, distribute the certificate to the endpoint machines. As per user or as per your computer configuration, you you can also create a common folder redirect to the endpoint machine. You can also deploy the custom script to the user configuration or the computer configurations. Okay, you can also display the to the endpoint machines. You can see here what display we can here you can retain existing settings retain existing settings font dpi you can set the resolution display all those things centrally to the endpoint machines okay so what we can other things we can do here we can uh, drive mapping to the endpoint machine we can create environment variable also and settings to deploy to the endpoint machine through centrally to multiple machines you can deploy uh, these settings through the manage engine console folder file and folder operations you can deploy firewall setting you can also deploy to the endpoint machines folder backup also you can deploy folder redirection you can create here font you can deploy directly to the endpoint machine and general settings you can also deploy here what general settings you can deploy here? I am showing you. It takes some time. So this type of uh, last like uh, registry company time savers. This type of setting you can deploy directly to the endpoint machines. Okay, group management you can create here and deploy IP printer. Also you can deploy to the endpoint machines. Legal notice you can send to the endpoint machines. Launch application, al although you can also launch application to the endpoint machines directly to the console. You can also install or uninstall patches to the endpoint machines. Okay. You can also in install or uninstall a software to the endpoint machines. You can also launch applications. These all type of settings, scheduler you can deploy, you can path also deploy, you can permission management also do from the console to the endpoint machines. Power management you can do here and send to the endpoint machines directly from the console. Registry you can deploy, registry setting to the endpoint machines. Services you can stop or start through the console. You can also enable Wi Fi, disable Wi Fi settings to the endpoint machines from uh, directly to the console you can create here the user management to the endpoint machines you can also create a shortcuts to the all the endpoint machines sent to directly to the console to the endpoint machines you can also create a configure share printers or scheduler to the uh, deployment to the endpoint machine so these are the configuration settings benefit of these tools if you like this video please like comment share and subscribe my channels thanks for watching